Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Destiny on Death. It's Tuesday, which means it's reset day, January 26, 2016. We got new stuff going on, so let's talk about it. <clears throat> hey, Raul, what you got for us? So, Raul, this week is selling class items, primaries, secondaries, and heavy weapon Ingrams. So, if you want any of that stuff, you can take a gamble there. Play his casino. Uh, you're probably going to lose. It's full of salt and deception. <clears throat> but we're going to walk around, look at all the vendors, see what materials they're accepting for exchange and we'll talk about the weekly activities going on this week so the weekly crucible not the iron banner but just the weekly crucible where you can get 30 legendary marks 10 for each of the first three wins is mayhem rumble which is interesting to me i kind of like the idea of mayhem rumble so i'll be into that uh future war cult is taking worm spore donations today's dailies uh the daily pvp is salvage the daily pve is the promethean code so Nothing special in today's PvE, but go in there and get some marks if you need them. Future War Cult is accepting helium filament, so if you got an excess of helium filaments, you can level up your uh, Dead Orbit faction rank. We're going to head on over to New Monarchy. We'll talk about Tier 3 Court of Oryx and Nightfall. So, Tier 3 this week of Court of Oryx is Thalnok, the Fanatic of Crota. So, if you have a desire to go in there and pretend to kill Crota again and get that last calcified fragment from him, go do it. Uh, I, I have a bunch of those that I need to do, actually. I don't think I ever got the Calcified Fragment from him. So, <clears throat> that's something I need to go and do. But I haven't. The Nightfall this week is the Dust Palace. Again, for like the millionth time. Bungie just does, does, does not want to throw new strikes at us. It's the Dust Palace. New Monarchy, what you taking? New Monarchy. We'll talk about the modifiers in just a second. New Monarchy is taking Spirit Bloom. We're going to make our way back to the Crucible guy. Go talk to Eris. But the Nightfall this week is the Dust Palace. It is epic as usual. That's one of the modifiers. The other modifiers are Solar Burn, Brawler, so your Guardian's punches will be stronger. Ironclad, more enemies have shields, and Airborne, you do more damage in the air. Which is interesting to me. So if you're, if you're a Titan, get that Taken Out Helmet. If you're a Warlock, turn on Angel of Light and go ahead and hang in the air. Eris, I believe, is taking Worm Spore. Ooh, got the slow run on. Eris is taking, yep, Worm Spore. And the Crucible weekly bounties are pretty much the same as they always are, but we'll take a look at them. You have to win two matches with at least 1,500 points. No, just complete two matches with 1,500 points. Win seven matches, win one of each of those matches, Control, Clash, and Rift. Uh, get five points in the daily, PvP. Three, win three points for a win, one point for a loss. Complete five matches with a fire team of two or more, so you can do that in Trials every weekend. And then complete all five of the bounties to unlock this one and get the unknown reward, which will be a ghost shell or strange coins. Just just saying. I'm just saying. That's what I've gotten the last three weeks in a row every time I've done it. So there you go, guys. That is, oh, the challenge mode. Challenge mode this week is Oryx. So you got to kill everything all at once with huge, huge explosions. Have fun with that. But anyway, guys, I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for watching. Leave a like if you enjoyed, enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you want to see more of my videos. Let me know you enjoy what I'm doing. And I'm going to get out of here. Thanks for watching. Until next time, I will see you later. See you. Bye.